we have um, uh, the, the neighborhood is flat, it's because we can explain a phenomenon of a wind coming from the southeast. Coming from the southeast means that it's blocking the exit of the water towards the ocean. So it comes uh, back to the coast and it makes the water increases the level. Sometimes can be one meter, one meter and a half, two meters. Hoy no me haces un favor, no te fijas en la segunda de la vía. Hay un montón de pibes, me golpearon el micro. Sí. En la, en la primera esta no, en la segunda y la vía. Son un par de pibes, de pibes que están golpeando a todos los micros, a todo lo que pasa. Ok. This was, this exactly area we are crossing was since the beginning of the Spanish conqueror arrival was the harbor of Buenos Aires. This was an active harbor up to more or less 1960. Of course, since 1875, there was another big harbor in the city and it's the next area we will cross and it's Puerto Madero. Uh, this one and the next are not the commercial harbors of Buenos Aires anymore. So we have a third area in the north where Buenos Aires is still the exit or entrance of many kinds of wood. Uh, this harbor was exactly the right uh, Santa Maria de los Buenos Aires. And the city was never named Buenos Aires, but the Holy Trinity. It happens that as the time went by, the harbor was much more important than the city itself, and the area got the name of the harbor. That's why we finally uh, named Buenos Aires uh, the, the, this, um, in this way. You see on the right side, uh, two or three things I would like to point. A uh, lot of sand, first of all. We have lots of... Uh, um, shipyards uh, in this area so 